Now, there are several limitations with Chernobyl. One is the amount of types that this thing supports. In 2025, in part of 2026, we support only ints, strings, arrays, and other types that also support general. But the primitives that are supported are just ints and strings. For example, I tried to use dates and it's not supported yet. I think in the future, I'm gonna support more and more types, but just keep that in mind. That's one of the reasons why I also had to split the implementation of models into two. For example, I want to keep this mill to be separated from the actual model that I want to generate for two things. One is for simplicity, but also for keeping the actual generable models and also to improve the speed of the response. Because the more types, the more properties you add here, the slower will be your response. So keep that in mind. Don't generate something that you're not fully using in your UI or in your business logic.